Hi everyone, in today's video I am going to show you how to lock the bootloader on any Google Pixel phone including the Pixel 7 Pro, Pixel 6 Pro, Pixel 5a and older models. Locking the bootloader on your device can help you secure your phone and prevent from unauthorized access. So let's get started on how to lock the bootloader. There are some requirements for locking the bootloader on a Google Pixel phone. First of all, make sure your phone is running on stock firmware. If your phone is rooted with Mages, make sure to install stock firmware using Android Play tool. The link is given in the description of this video on how to use and play stock firmware using Android Play tool. Now, locking the bootloader will factory reset and erase all data on your device, so it is recommended to backup your phone. Also enable developer options to enable the USB debugging option on your phone. Finally, you need to install ADB and fastboot drivers on your PC. I have made another separate tutorial on how to install ADB and fastboot drivers on a Windows PC. The link is also given in the description of this video. Now, to enable developer options, Go to Settings app, scroll down and tap on About Phone and scroll down, tap on the bell number for about 7 times. Now go back, tap on System and here you will find the developer options, scroll down. Now as you can see, it, is, it says your bootloader is already unlocked. Now scroll down and find the USB debugging option. Toggle this way to the right and to enable USB debugging. Now you can connect your phone to PC using a USB cable. On your phone, you will get the option to allow USB debugging. Check on Always Allow from this computer and tap on Allow. Now on your PC, open the command prompt. I will open the Platform Tools folder. Type cmd in the address bar and hit enter key on your keyboard. It will open the command prompt. Then type adb device and hit enter. As you can see, my phone is connected. Now I will type adb reboot bootloader to boot my phone into fast boot mode. Hit enter and it will boot your phone into pass boot mode as you can see my phone is now in pass boot mode. Now I will type pass boot devices. To make sure my device is recognized in fast boot mode, as you can see, it is recognized. Now I will type fast boot flashing lock. This command will lock the bootloader on your phone. Hit enter key on the keyboard. Now as you can see on your phone, you should get a notification to lock the bootloader. So using the volume key, select the lock bootloader and confirm using power key. Now as you can see the device state is changed to lock before it was unlocked. Now I will type fast boot reboot to reboot my phone. Fast boot reboot and hit enter key. Now my phone is rebooted. 
once the phone is booted it will ask you to set up your phone like you would normally do after a hard reset tap on get started connect to a wi-fi network i will skip this setup offline Accept the terms and condition. Getting your phone ready. Now I will connect to a Wi-Fi network. Now go to settings just to confirm that bootloader has successfully been locked. Now I will. Tap on bell number for about 7 times to enable developer options. Go back, tap on system, scroll down and open developer options. Now as you can see OEM unlocking allow the bootloader to be unlocked. So it is now locked. If you want to unlock the bootloader again, I have made another separate tutorial. The link is given in the description of this video. Thank you for watching. If, if you have found this video useful, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this.